Members of the Iowa football team met the media today in Iowa City, including two former Michigan Wolverines who now call Iowa City home. Blake Hornstein was there, and he has our report. Hawkeye fans, it's time to get to know your QB1. Cade McNamara spoke to reporters for the first time today, and the new quarterback of the Iowa Hawkeyes is a Big Ten champion. Actually, he beat Iowa on the Michigan Wolverines back in 2021. He brings a championship pedigree and some interesting stories from his teammates. Take a listen. This is a chip on your shoulder type of program, and I think, you know, I think that was also very intriguing to me is that just the culture that Coach Ferentz has created here is awesome and I think you know I'm just so happy to be a part of it and I think I gel into it nice and I think you know I'm just going to continually try and do everything I can to make sure that I can prove myself that you know to my teammates and to my coaches. He's just a huge competitor with anything when we golf um, he <laughs> he throws his he <laughs> when he gets real mad he throws his club at the cart. <laughs> <laughs> That's probably the most funniest thing with uh, with Cade being around Cade. He's a great guy. Obviously, we haven't had spring ball yet or games or anything like that. So just what really sticks out to me so far is how much of a leader he is. You could tell that everyone on the team respects him already when he talks in meetings and stuff like that. He sounds extremely intelligent. intelligent. Now the Hawkeyes offense has its fair share of naysayers. The team finished 130th in yards per game last year. But McNamara told reporters that motivation is one of the reasons he chose Iowa City. And if you don't believe in the Hawkeyes, well, just keep doubting us. In Iowa City, Blake Hornstein, Hawkeye Headquarters.